all right so welcome back to another video tech savage pro here and i was thinking the other day you know i play a lot of rocket league here lately um i actually have it open in fact um and yeah so i play a lot of rocket league um i think it's a good game but yeah so i was thinking um what's a good way that i could uh show this game off on my channel and i started to think and then i realized why not um, make a video on showing you how to get Bakke's mod? So um, basically, before I go ahead and get into this, um, it's going to be a very simple uh, process, of course. Um, but yeah, so before I go ahead and get into the video, I want to go ahead and give a mention to my uh, lovely Discord that I have. You can go ahead and join it. And also, we have almost hit 6,000 subscribers. So let's keep rolling. Let's get to 10K by the end of 2020. Um, and of course, you know, go ahead and leave a like. Let's get a whopping two likes on this video. Big goal, but I know that we can do it. Um, yeah, so enough with the ums. Let's get straight into it. So I recommend uh, making sure that your Rocket League application is open. Um, and if you're wondering why my actual screen looks like this, it's because I have the windowed version right here so I'm just gonna have that so that I can pull it around and do uh, different things while still running Rocket League alright so like I said make sure that you do uh, join my discord if you want it's called Tech Talk it's pretty much a community uh, based around pretty much whatever it's called Tech Talk but it's not necessarily tech related uh, just give it a give it a look it's in the description below along with all my other socials in case you need any help uh, following the video or something like that so yeah let's get into it so if you go ahead and you go to YouTube and you look up Baka's mod you can actually find a lot of videos on it so I have looked at them and they're kind of garbage uh, but what you want to do is you want to go ahead and look up Baka's mod of course all links will be in the description and if not go ahead and look in the community tab or the comment section so what you want to do once you do look that up, you want to go ahead and click it, and then you will see Bakke's mod. Now this is free, and we'll get into the benefits and why you should get it right now. So why I think that you should get it is you can do a lot of things, like you can do training way easier, you can actually download workshop maps way easier, you can get any car design that you want, which we're going to be doing in this video. So yeah, uh, we're going to go ahead and install it. It actually tells you how to install it um, if you run into any any issues along the way, which I think that we're going to because I actually have my uh, setup in this folder right here, which is actually my SSD instead of my, my main hard drive. So yeah, uh, most of you are going to have it in your C drive, but I actually have mine in my D drive. So yeah but what you want to go ahead and do is make sure that you do download it so go ahead click here to download it's gonna download something called Baka's mod injector zip go ahead and click this arrow show in folder and you're gonna go ahead and click twice on this it's gonna pull up this right here and then just go ahead and click double click on it um so you may have uh, this error come up you're just gonna go ahead and disable that and then open it again and then you're gonna go ahead and click more info and run anyway it is not a virus it's perfectly safe um, and then it's gonna go ahead and install the files that you need so it's gonna go ahead and say for me an update is available fixed to make Baka's mod work for Rocket League 1.76. Would you like to update? Go ahead and click yes. Usually you're going to want to click yes unless there is some kind of bug or something. But a lot of YouTube videos uh, tr tell you that you need to install WinRAR or 7-Zip. You don't need to download either one of those. Just double click on the file. It'll open it. Um, and actually Windows has a built-in a built-in extractor so that's pointless to start off with if you're curious on how to do that you can go ahead and go 
down and then there's actually an extractor usually so yeah once you do actually have this open and the files have run through it's gonna say injected press F2 in game for options menu now if you don't have your Rocket League open like I do then you're going to need to reopen it or open it and then it's actually going to inject once it's open so once you have that done then you're gonna go ahead and want to restart your game which is what I'm gonna do so I'm gonna go ahead and restart my game and like it said we're gonna go ahead and press F2 and we should have Baka's mod up and running now we're not gonna really look at a whole lot of um, the training stuff today but we're gonna be looking at kind of the perks of like customizing your car stuff like that so once we get to the main menu if it worked we can press F2 and there it is oh my gosh this is so cool so um, air dribble mode we're gonna go ahead and head into alright so we're gonna go ahead and head into items let's see enable item mode we can actually get the 20xx uh, item as you can see uh, we can get the let's see what what else do we want we can go ahead and put that on there engine audio pretty much anything that we want is in this game like literally anything that's ever been in Rocket League we can get it we can get the alpha gold cap we can get the alpha boost we can get these wheels right here we can get anything that we want and it's it's really cool actually so I'm gonna go ahead and just trick out my car right here with a bunch of stuff that is completely unnecessary um, the one thing that you do need to know if you're gonna do this is that you're gonna be the only one to see this stuff so your car that I the car that I had before I started modding it um, is still underneath the decals like the actual car model will still be seen like to other online players so it's not like it's gonna like mess up your game or anything like that it's not like it's cheating um, you can still trade but you're gonna be trading like regular items and um, like your regular items will still show up so like if I do that all your regular items still show up it's just pretty much overlaid it if that makes any sense um, so we can go ahead and head into training something like uh, this and we can go ahead and press F2 again and we can do let's see air dribble mode so uh, once we go ahead and do that then we should be able to just plop the ball down on top of our car I'm not really entirely sure how to do that but I do know that it is possible um, and also as you can tell I do have the alpha boost on my car so that's super super cool it's really really fun to play with and this does go away so you can go ahead and just continue with your day play with your controller all that good stuff um, you know score a nice easy goal but yeah so I want to go ahead and see what else we have in here so disables all variants and custom training um, wall hit mode super super cool really uh, it's it's very interesting how how you can use this um, I'm trying to figure out how I can actually show y'all this is my first time using this so I really don't know too much about it also another cool thing about this is it actually shows the MMR notification um so and there's also use a for full ranked icons okay that's that's kind of weird so um you can make it to where it automatically says gg at the end of the maps matches um super useful like i highly recommend uh checking it out and it's very seamless like as you could tell it doesn't matter what drive you have it on um it just goes goes ahead and uh, downloads all the needed files that you could possibly need super super easy to use and I really do recommend it once again not a virus um, not a sponsored video or whatever 
but I will leave a link in the description on where you could donate if you do want to because it does take quite a bit of money for this guy this is made by one guy um, and it's it's very expensive for him to keep this up and it's also very generous of him to keep this mod up for free uh, having how much it costs so this is not his full-time job either um, just because of how little pay it is and he's being very generous to keep this up so if you do want to I'm probably gonna plan on doing it after the video but you can use the link that I'm gonna leave in the description to donate and actually you know support him because it does take a lot to keep this up so yeah um custom training free play let's see enable um, unlimited flips I don't really know what that means use normal car color automatically limit boost so all of this is super 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 cool okay so I've actually think that I figured out how to get it to work all right so I want to see oh, okay so another thing that you can do is you can actually make the car like do things like that so like it'll shoot it and then you can actually like freestyle things like that so you can do like practice aerials do things like that so if you hit like left on the d-pad it'll shoot the ball up in the air things like that super super useful and yeah I think it's it's genuinely helpful oh that's that's a good one um let's see if I can hit it no cuz I'm garbage alright so I'm gonna go ahead and hit this uh, sick aerial right here we're gonna freestyle and that's gonna be the end of the video hopefully you did uh, you did like the video if you did make sure that you uh, leave a like and subscribe of course uh, join my uh, my discord also I have been streaming on twitch lately so I'll leave that in the description as well if you want to check that out um, because you know I don't really stream um, on YouTube anymore due to some of the rules that they have so yeah but hopefully you did like this video if you did make sure that you do subscribe because I will have more content like this coming out I'll have uh, like training videos on like how to use Baka's mod things like that um, just a cool little you know tip um, not that it's like relevant for half of my viewers right now who are new to the videos that I'm gonna be putting out like this but for Rocket League fans um, Justin actually uses Baka's mod before tournaments so yeah it's super super useful I highly recommend it and once again it's free so you have really nothing to lose so yeah hopefully you did like this video make sure that you subscribe and give a follow as always peace out and I'll see you in the next one